Hello, I am Bentham and welcome back to the Factorio No Crafting Challenge where we are now in update 0.11.5. Look, the walk animation has changed. Still not sure about it. Better than before though, looks more realistic at, the, at least. They're probably going to do some more work on it, I imagine. But anyway, um, we're going to start off this episode um, with a bang. Specifically, this bang. Wait, C, there we go. And let's just... Keep on shooting until it is annihilated. And there we go. Right. So, yeah. Update 0.11.5. One of the things that has been introduced, pretty much the only thing actually, because it was mostly bug fixes and important things like that, um, was that now things that take more than four part f four things can be crafted. And this, of course, includes the refinery. The reason that I crafted it manually um, earlier was because it was the only way you could craft it now this can be made in a level 3 assembler however another thing is that um, a level 3 assembler um, can we let's see do we have it on here is it oh I, I can't even show you right a level 3 assembler uses speed modules speed modules need advanced circuits advanced circuits need plastic plastic needs oil and therefore you need this to make the level 3 assemblers, therefore I am allowed to have one. But any more than that, nope, so that's why I blew it up. So yeah, we're going to be running on one of these for a while until we can sort things out and get uh, module production operational so that we can actually continue get the necessary assembler and so on and then get some automatic production of this stuff. So yeah, um, that's a shame because we might have some problems with the supplies of various things. Actually, no, we won't, because it looks like plastic has now built up, because, of course, advanced circuit production isn't feeding into anything, and so once it's built up, it will stop. Um, so it looks like all the oil is now going into sulfur production, which is good, because we needed that, because it wasn't working before. How's oil doing? Absolutely fine. It's going to be doing better than ever at the moment, thanks to me blowing up that refinery. Has this run out? No, it hasn't. Okay. So, yep, yeah, this is operating. Sulfuric acid is slowly but surely building up. Um, do we have some... We don't have... Any underground pipes on us? Let's go grab some of those because uh, that's one of the things that we need for things that we're doing. Today we are going to set up battery production. That's the first order of business and we'll work from there. So that's some underground pipes. Actually we'll get some more normal pipes because I imagine we'll need some. Not that many though. We'll get... Oh! Ah! Cars! Right. Let's research for some modules because we're going to need those. Actually, wait, let's check if there's anything else important. Um, it doesn't look like it at a glance. Nothing we can get yet without blue signs. So yeah, we'll research speed modules. They are the most urgent now because of the the new stuff. Um, I don't want quite as many as that in terms of pipes. Right, let's go over here. Do we have a chemical plant handy? We do not. We need to grab one of those as well. Conveniently, we have a factory right here for just such a purpose. Um, how are we for everything else? Um, that all looks fine. Maybe some more belts as well. I'm being clever this time. I'm picking up all the things I need before I go and find out that I'm, I'm missing them. Um, there we go. Wait, splitters and underground belts. Are we out of underground belts? I don't see any on me, so I will call that a yes. Uh, speaking of which, we have something to fix when we get over to the base. I did a bit of a derp. So over we go. We'll ride along these belts to speed up. Steel's building up. Iron isn't actually... We'll fix it in a second because we're going over here now. We might as well finish what we're doing over here. So, yeah. This underground belt here, look closely. It's going backwards. Yes, that's how much of, of a stupid I am. I did it backwards. There we go. Now it's running again and the steel can flow in. I'm I'm... I don't know how I even managed to be that stupid, but anyway, we need to set up battery production. I think we will do it right about here. Let's clear this tree away. I don't think there's any other trees around. Right, battery production. We where is it? We need iron, copper, sulfuric acid. Easy. There's iron and copper right here. Okay, we'll get some splitters on it. And I wonder, can we? Hmm, how, how to do... We'll do like this. Oh, 
clear all these away. Get some underground belts. This going like this. And there we go. So there's something. I feel like there was another thing to do. Actually, I don't think there was. I think I'm just getting confused and distracted. Right, so we need... Oh, the pipes is what we need. Let's bring the pipes along. Um, so they're on, they're on the outside, aren't they? I'm not going to connect up because I may have to break pipes. And at the moment, we don't have a brilliant supply of sulfuric acid. So I don't want to waste it by breaking pipes. So that's one underground pipe, and that's another. We can get to there. And then we can get this going somewhere. Not sure y where yet, so we'll break that. So we need we need an input and output, and then we need to fit some pipes into the equation. Um, yeah, should be simple enough. All we need to do is something along these lines. Leave a bit of a gap here so we can fit some underground belt stuff in. Let's work out if we can fit this in some... Oh, it's a bit of an awkward position. There's not much room for stuff and things. We'll have it just hop along a little bit. It's it's a bit messy, but it works. And it will hopefully still allow us to fit in uh, lubricant uh, pipes later on. Uh, let's get this in place. And then we can get some conveyors. And then the conveyors can go into underground belts. Oh, there goes some research. Let's do efficiency modules next. Oh, we'll keep these going. We want to connect up to um, advanced circuits. Do we want it to do that right now? Mm, well, maybe actually, because they're all, they're all loaded onto the same side of the belt, which is really convenient. So if we just get like a splitter here, is this going to work? It might just work. Let's test it. Yes, it does. Awesome. That's like a new invention there. Anyway, um, we need to tell this what it's doing. Make batteries. And there you go. Um, so now you need to actually get the sulfuric acid connected up. And we can do that by just sticking in these pipes here. So the sulfuric acid is now coming through, and battery production has commenced, and there they are. Excellent. And we'll just get these going along like this. And this thing can pick him up, which is excellent. It's not perfect, I don't think. Maybe it is. <laughs> Maybe it is perfect. We'll have to just watch it and see how things go with that. So there we go, they're all connected. It's all flowing along. And is the blue science ready? Is it here? Or is it going along? It goes through all these underground belts and such. Power's a bit fiddly, even after blowing up that refinery. Hmm. We'll have to see about putting in some more steam engines, methinks. Come on, go. Make the blue science. Yes, here it comes. Oh, there's one over there as well. Yay! Oh, red science. Oh, yeah, red science was always a problem. We need to go sort out iron. I think I'll do that now because everything over there is fine as far as I can see. Oh wow, the walking animation looks very weird from up here because you can't see his arms. So it looks like he's just sort of flailing about as he walks. Right. Um, yeah, so this has, has stopped because we don't have enough iron coming through because this mining drill over here has run out. So we'll just clear away all of this gubbins. Oh, this mining drill's off. What's that about? Oh, it's not flowing fast enough. That's the problem. Okay, I did think that it seemed like there were too many mining drills for this to just run out. Okay, so we need to get some some red belts then. Ooh, red belts. Unless we did a bit of a of a, a cheat, and we had two separate line. No, that's no no. What am I what am I thinking? That's just too complicated. This thing's just shut down over here. How many advanced circuits does it take? That five. So I have five. So I'll just put them in. Um, let's help this along a bit by just sticking these random iron plates in there. I don't know why I have those. Just keep ending up with them. Oh yeah, I picked them up when I cleared a belt. This is all running fine, it looks like. But we do need to sort out this congestion that's here. It's a big problem. This mine drill's just off. This one's helping the situation, I guess. Because, yeah, the gaps form before this is put into the system. That's a point. Yeah, we could have 
the the ore added in later on that would be a help well, I don't know let's go fix the power system because that's a thing that's happening right now we'll repurpose this thing to do all the stuff again okay make me some steam engines if you please you need some pipes how much of what do you need you need 20 pipes so we don't have enough there I think I'll just grab a ton because you need them for all sorts of random bits of bobs. I just realised I have three electric furnaces right here. Do productivity research. So I just have a, a ton of these furnaces already, which is good. Um, that should be enough pipes for that. Oh, we'll just grab all of them. Or a stack. Whatever. And we'll go back over. I don't think there's any particularly fiddly stuff these need. Now this is just plates and gears and such. Alright, we want to give you... 20 and then we need some some what, what do we need of what how much we're going to need 20 gears 20 plates all right then we'll just ride this belt along for a bit there we go that's enough have all that and i'll just grab these as they get produced okay next job is to make boilers and for that you will need pipes and stone furnaces. We'll just dump all the pipes in, then we'll limit it using stone furnaces, which we now don't have enough of. Hmm. Okay, one second. Make stone furnaces, please. We just want one. And that will be enough. There we go. Oh. And then go back to making the boilers. Have those. And then however much you need of this. I think it's, oh, it's one each. Well, that's easy enough then. Right, and I'll steal those pipes back, take those boilers, and I think that's all we need of that. Yeah, that should be it. Okay, um, break that, so the the steam engines will spool down, which is a cool thing. Oh no, they've, they've just shut straight off because I disconnected the water supply. Okay, so some boilers, and then we'll put the steam engines on the end. And then we need to put in the burner inserters. Don't have any handy, but there is some production of them here. Let's see, we'll grab them out of here because that works. There we go. Five burner inserters. This is in the way. Hopefully it doesn't break anything. It, it breaks things. It broke a lot of things. Hold up. There we go. Calm down. Doesn't matter. You've got power. It's all good. Right. And then we need to put one coal in each of these. One, two, three, four, five. And there goes the water heating up. And I believe we have now... There we go. We, we, our production has jumped up and can now once again deal with the demands of the system. Excellent. I mean, it's not that much, actually. We'll probably need to upgrade it again fairly soon. There might even be times where it still has power problems, but it has less power problems than before, and that's important. And these have run out of coal, because I forgot about them, like I always do. Here you go, you'll be fine. Yeah, we need to go out and grab some more coal. I could connect it up, but I'm lazy, and it'll probably be fine. I'll steal all that. I hope the system doesn't have some trouble from me taking all of that. Put these in. Well, this and this. Need a bit more for that one. And I guess for general supplies too. Now that's a dangerous thing to do. That could shut down the system, just completely clearing the belts there. Alright, at the moment we don't even need that last furnace probably. We might go repurpose that for iron. Though at the moment we have so many of these electric furnaces that I might just switch over this system over here. Because that shouldn't be too hard. If I just do the steel system first and then work from there that shouldn't cause problems or maybe I, I should move the steel production somebody did suggest that because at the moment we don't have much room for iron production actually it makes no difference where the steel is produced because it still uses the iron so yeah we'll just stick it on here let's get rid of this um, and then let's put that belt back in so we don't have the whole thing just shut down on us oh there goes more science still don't have it actually ooh, I could try a blue science now I might do that I might go for advanced oil processing, that's always the one I go for first. Though given the situation, maybe we should go for automation 3 instead, because that'll give us the assembling machine, but then again I have not yet set up any module production, so it's going to be a while. 75, that's not too much of a cost, let's try switching that on. 
It might slow science down for a bit while it tries to deal with that, but whatever. It'll probably be fine. All right. Let's clear away some of this stuff. We'll disconnect the inserters. That's usually a good way of doing it. Um, do you know, we have some more of these. We have one more. Well, that's two sets of steel production. I'd like to get a bit more, maybe. Actually, I don't know. If we don't have enough room, actually, to fit all that in. So uh, we'll just connect this one as well. We can't yet get rid of this because we've got a few more furnaces yet that would need dealing with, but that's all right. Okay, these are all shutting down now, so we can just clear this all away. Oh, we've disconnected everything. I keep doing that. Why is it connected up there? That doesn't even make sense. Connect down here, like a logical thing. Let's just clear this stuff away for a minute. We'll probably put it back, but maybe in a different orientation once we've got the electric furnaces set up. All these cleared away. Uh, the belt's cleared away. Actually, we need to clear away this one as well because it's significantly wider, what with there being two upgraded furnaces. Yep, that's all we can fit in here. That lines up nicely with the ones on this side, though, so that's nice. Um, so we need to put in some inserters. Oh, that's just that's in the way. Hang on, oh, we'll put the inserter up here to try and extract it as soon as possible because that will help alleviate the, the congestion that exists. So we'll put these like this. And we have some steel production, though we have less steel production than before um, because of how things have turned out. Um, I, I, I suppose I'll just extend this down a fair bit and then join it up where it needs to be joined up to keep the system running properly. And there we go. So this is all running nicely now. Making steel, we could do with some more production of it, but we can work on that. Thing is, there's there's not much room for stuff right now. We're gonna have some trouble. We, we need to get this out of the way and then just extend all of this down, because that'll give us a lot more. Actually, that'll give us tons more production if we just keep extending this. I like that idea, but we'll have to move this for that, and I cannot be bothered. We'll get it making a bunch of furnaces so that when it's time to actually extend it a bit more. It's, it's it's high time now, what with the not being enough iron and steel maybe. Uh, but we'll go get a bunch of advanced circuits, stick them all in the system, and that should be dandy. We'll get everything working. We'll just steal everything off here. Until it runs down. That's pretty much everything there. Let's get it off here as well, because there's no batteries coming down here. I mean, I could pick up some batteries, it wouldn't be a problem. There we go. How much do we have here? 135. That will definitely keep us supplied. That's probably too much. I might have to limit how much I actually put into the assembler. Uh, the sulfur supply has stopped now, because now that we've got... Um, well, as, as soon as we've got battery production going, that meant that... Um, Advanced circuits were being used up, which meant plastic was being used up, so there was no more oil for the sulfur for the battery production. So an interesting sort of cycle could end up occurring, where it keeps sort of switching between the two types of production, and then one fills up or whatever. Oh, I'm putting that in the complete wrong thing. What am I doing? Right, so that'll make us ten. Ten will be enough. That'll keep us going. And once we've got these phased out, we'll be able to just get rid of the the coal side of this and then we'll be able to put twice as much on the belt and we want to upgrade the belt I mean I could just upgrade the belts that is also an option though now that we've messed things about a bit it's all gone fine again and built up I wonder if we should put this other mining drill in seeing as we have it handy I suppose there's no reason not to or if there is I don't know what it is and then we'll connect that up here or something that'll work and we've got another mining drill on us as well. Right, how are these going? Three already. We'll just leave that to do its thing. Ah, the steel's running out though, so it's going to take a lot longer for it to finish off. So there's basically only one steel furnace worth going actually onto the line, and that's the stuff that isn't taken by this production first. Hmm. It's not optimal, but it's alright probably. Right, what to work on next? Oh, this stone's nearly running out, actually. We could do something about that. We can connect up this stone supply. How much is the right now? That's full. That's full. That's not full. That's got barely anything in it. It's not too bad yet, then. 
Resupply. I don't know if I really need to resupply. Ah, there we go. Advanced oil processing. Yes. Excellent. What to work on next? I feel like we should oscillate between... Well, alternate. Alternate is the word between something that requires blue and something that doesn't. Because um, that'll probably turn out better. Ooh. I th I'm thinking logistics bots. Yeah, I'm going to go for robotics. Even though it's going to be ages before I set, set that up again. I'm really not ready with all this. Let's check up on the factory, see how that's working. 